Hello everybody. Um, I've decided I've had some requests to make videos uh, about my entire Raggedy Ann collection. Most y'all have mainly gotten glimpses and views of it. And some people on the Raggedy Ann and Andy Collectors.com Facebook site or page have requested to see a full, you know, just a whole video about all the dolls. Raggedy dolls. And, um, I'm answering. I would like to dedicate this video to my friend, Breen, who has helped to fuel my love for Raggedy Ann and Andy's, as also as other dolls, and, um, who has also contributed some wonderful, wonderful dolls to me. Okay, so let's get started because this video might take a while. Lens cap. Sorry. <sighs> okay. I'm going to start over here. First, I'm going to start off with this girl on the floor. My, um, 85th anniversary, birthday anniversary, Rag Dean and Andy. Year 2000. She, this is her original box. I took her out of her little, her little wires because, I mean, she's a doll. It's her destiny to be played with, so I figured I'd bring her out, play with her a little bit, you know. She got a paper, too, and her teddy bear, her Andy bear. She's just cute, adorable, and fluffy. I love her. Oh, hold on. Okay, just making sure there's not something on my lens. Okay. And if y'all saw my other video, this is my second Rag the Andy. The one I love the most. As you can see, he's well loved and played with. But I still love him. I love his eyes because they kind of... So I'm going to paint to them. They kind of have like a little swirled effect. And you look into them. It's, I don't know. It just gives them character. He's holding a little knickerbocker hand. And he's sitting in a large knickerbocker hand's lap. This is a big girl. She's got... Her, her wig is not in perfect shape. But it's still there. Her dress. She's missing her knickers. Her bloomers. Or shall I say. And, um, she has her little cloth in her pocket, which is usually missing. I'm not sure about this pattern. It looks like, uh, rose and daisies. It's cute. Okay. Now, we're getting to the section where uh, mo uh, my friend Brain comes in. My friend Brain is not just a gifted restorer of Raggedy Ann and Andy's, but maker. He found these two. And he um, fixed them up. And they're great. They go together, of course. They both have, He made them with vertical striped socks, which I think is just great. Their outfits are great. I love their eyes. And I love the um, outline, black outlined nose, nose and mouth. Uh, I just like that detail. It makes it pop. Hats and outfits are beautiful. They're soft and cuddly. Great, great to just snuggle with. I love to snuggle with them. And then here comes to one of my other favorites. I love this one. She's got, um, the kind of like the copper brown hair. And, um, her little shiny eyes. The cute little face. This is a 40s McCall pattern. She has a capelet, which kind of reminds me of Hocus Pocus and Winifred Sanderson. But I love it. And her dress is just so beautiful. Her hands and her legs. Jointed knee legs. Which makes good for any sitting on ledges or tables or in a chair. Um, you can take the hood off, of course. She is marked on the back by Brain. Which is a plus. She has her little hair loop-de-loops up here. Love it too. She's just a great doll. She's great quality. Sewn by hand. Including the clothes. 
I mean, you can't get much better than that. Someone literally put, you know, hard work into this doll, and she's beautiful. Okay. Here's a pair of Georgians. And, um... They are very cute. Okay. This Georgian right here, this outfit right here was made by Breen. He actually came dressed in an Ann outfit. <laughs> and Breen told me that's a girl, that's a Andy, not Ann. And I'm like, oh, okay. So he made this outfit for me and it's really cute. It's even got the hat. Okay. And here's um my Georgian Ann. She's got the two-colored hair. She's got the bow in her hair. She's actually wearing a knickerbocker outfit. Which, and some replacement bloomers. I was kind of upset when I got home and I found out that these were not original clothing. Because I bought, like, three ands from the people. These two I bought together along with another and. But, apparently, these people made repairs or replaced some things like one of them was mistaken for an orange hair andy um knickerbocker andy and um was really a replacement wig and mm, i thought i had something rare and they did not tell me of the replacement or the repairs at the time so that's why it's always important to tell people what they're buying But still, they're still they're still great. I still love them. I love how on this one, if you look at this eye, you can see a little girl or a little boy, you never know, has tried to draw longer eyelashes for her. It's just that little human touch that makes her unique. You know, it's the child's love. Okay. Moving on. Okay. I have this girl. She She's an Ann. I bought her outside of a shop. Outside of a variety shop. Um, she has some mold, sadly. But she's still beautiful and she's still cuddly. Still got her shaggy hair. She's got corduroy feet. She's nice and long. She'd actually be a great cunt, a country Ann. She's very sweet. She's a sweet girl. She's giving me no problems whatsoever. I cleaned her outfit up a little bit. Came out nice. Okay. Now this right here is a um, play school. It's a play school. Right at the end. And um, it's an educational toy, basically. She's an educational one. She's a rainy day Ann and... Basically, she's to teach kids how to unbuckle, unsnap, unbutton, untie, and tie, zip up and unzip, and all that lovely stuff. Here's her tag, play school, of course. She's cute. She's fluffy. What kid wouldn't want to take her to bed or out on a rainy day? You know, tuck them in their coat. Tuck them in their coat. This one I got from a yard sale many years ago. I think he was actually my third Rag Dandy ever. Um, he's got, you know, his striped socks, which are black, white, and red. His outfit's a little faded, because if you look on the back, that's what it's supposed to look like, and that's what it looks like on the front. You, you can tell it looks like a child tried to paint its nose and lips on him. And it has these unusual button eyes that just, they're dipped in, so it looks like they're staring at you. But he's nice. He's firmly stuffed, and he's cute. I like him. I swear, my ragdies are the hardest ones to try to get rid of. If I try to make room, I can't get rid of a ragdy. I try and try, and I can't. It's hard. Okay, this one looks handmade. Of course it does. But actually, it's got a tag from the Piccadilly Highway. No, um, Piccadilly Friendship Highway. Friendship Highway tag. 
this one might have a mate to it, a Ragdy Ann, but um, the seller did not bring her to the store because she was missing an arm and she wanted to replace the arm before she sell her. I'm about to just go up there and tell her just to bring her in and sell her to me and I'll have someone make an arm because it's just taking her a long time. Okay. I have a bedtime Anne. Now, I think she has the sweetest face. Look at that. It's just so cute. You want to pinch her cheeks? Pinch. Hair loop D. For some reason, I just think the hair loop D is for little kids that can wrap their fingers into it and just drag them around by their hair. She has um her nightgown on, which is very cute. She has fuzzy pink slippers. My mom first thought that someone had made put them on there, and they weren't original. But yeah, they're original. I think she's from Play School also. Or, um, let me see. Actually, she's Hasbro. She's a Hasbro Raggedy Ants Bedtime Ann. And I need to tie up her nightgown. It's come loose. And it's starting to look like... She's starting to look like a floozy with it hanging off the shoulder. Okay. And I have this big Andy back here. His eyes and nose and stuff are glued on and drawn on with a marker, but that's no shame. He's still cute. Got a cute little outfit. He's, um, unique. Uh, this video is going I'm going to have to make two parts. This video into two parts, I can see already. But I'm going to continue until I don't have any more time. Okay. Keep moving on. This is a Knickerbocker Andy. He is in pretty darn good condition. Original outfit, hat, wig's good. He has his tag. Um, buttons, face. The only thing is his little hole right there. Other than that, he's good. He's cuddly. He wants a hug. Will you give him a hug? I'll give him a hug. I gave him a hug. He's cute. I love him. Raggedy Ann and Andy's make me want to hug. Okay. Here's my here's another Raggedy Ann. She has an interesting shape of a head. She's got some boo-boos. Looks like a dog. Um, but she's got this outfit with handmade by a little child's mother most likely you know you know she wants her little daughter wants to play dress up so the mother makes the Ann a um another outfit or so she's a knickerbocker she's got the knickerbocker, knickerbocker face and she's cute she's like trying to be different i liked her okay now this one is definitely, this is what you call a country bumpkin right here. He was well played with as you see. That, that hair comes from lots and lots of washing right there. But he's got the, you know, he's embroidered face, blue eyes. He's got the heart but no I love you. He's waiting for someone to say I love you. You know. He's wearing overalls. And, um, I don't know if those are his originally, but they're kind of a little too big. And look at his feet. That's why I bought them right there. Because it's just unique and unusual. But I love him. He's great. I bought him. I brought him home. For sure. Okay, this video is getting kind of long. So I'm going to have to say goodbye for now. And this will be part one. I will make part two. Okay. Thank you for watching. Leave comments. And have a good day. Bye.